Hello everyone. So welcome to the channel of RD Automation Learning. So today we are going to tell you about a very special tool that has got an expertise to generate automatically test data. What is test data? Now test data is a very important thing when you, you know, you perform testing. You might be performing any functional testing. You would need some test data to test some permutation and combinations related to that feature or functionality, right? So we have got an update about a very important tool that is known as auto test data. Yes, you heard it very right. It will automatically generate the test data for you in just a, in just you know one second, and that is just one click only. So generate your auto generate your test data automatically in just one second, and that is again uh, created by none other than Sanjay Kumar, who has also you know, created various tools like selectors, hub, testing daily. So auto test data is also one of the uh, tool that is added into the repository. So this feature is again, this tool is again free of cost. It is, uh, you don't need to pay anything. So we would be telling you about how to use auto test data in this particular video. But before that, if you're watching this video for the very first time, then please do like, share and subscribe our channel. Now let us see how to use auto test data. So this is the website autotestdata.com. You can just search auto test data on Google. We will be also mentioning this website in the comment section of this video. So you can go to this particular website and you can generate the auto, the test data automatically, right? Now you can see, choose the types of data that you want. So what type of data do you need? Okay, so this is the data type, this is the property name, and these are the options. You also have got option of copying, duplicating, and deleting, right? So this is too cool. Okay, now uh, let us generate some data, right? Because, and you have got all these data formats, right? It's available in JSON, XML, HTML, CSV, Excel, PHP, Ruby, Python, Perl, JavaScript, SQL separated by pipe. So a lot of, uh, you know, variety of data you will get, right? So you should really thank Sanjay Kumar and you should also follow all, uh, you know, his uh, Instagram account. So we will also put in the comment section of this video, the Instagram account, the LinkedIn profile and, uh, you know, the YouTube channel for selectors of where you will get an idea about all these kind of innovations that he individually has been doing right so he is his work is uh, you know reaching to the next level heights and it is very much helpful to the community now if you just uh, imagine you have to test some particular application and you have to generate test data so testers take some time in the sprint for generating test data only right so writing test cases designing test cases is one of the aspect generating test data is also one of the aspect right now if your test data is related to the application that is you need it you need to generate in your application itself right still you can use all this data so it has got the option to download also so you can download all these particular data that you would, would be generated and you can also preview it what kind of data is generated so you can get all that idea get all these kind of details from this particular video right so please don't wait, please don't, uh, you know, do manually this kind of test data generation because such a good tool is already available in the market. And it is again free of cost. You don't need to pay anything. You not even a single amount of, win, uh, you know, currency or rupee has been charged, right? So it is totally free of cost. You can sign up. You can also log in to use this particular website. See, it will allow you to generate the test data up to 99 the moment you go for 100 it will ask you to log in sorry for 100 also it is working so maybe i think thousand for okay. yeah yeah so for that it will ask you to log in right see it is asking us to log in right so you can log in you don't need to pay anything you can log in with your accounts and you can use this test data. Okay, now let us generate some data and I'll show you how you can generate. Okay. 
see for now let us generate only this uh, names phone email right let's say if i don't want to uh, you know get this international number so i'll add plus 91 this will be our india related phone numbers that we will get emails also it will come okay now add if you want to add some one more data type so let's say if i want to add country name in this so i can click on add so automatically i'll get six types of data okay let me show it to you practically first okay now let's say if i am generating in uh, which format would you like to go for okay let's go for xml format okay now let's generate okay so this is the xml format it has come okay see full name phone email currency number Full, full name, phone, email, currency, and number, right? Now, again, in number also, you can add some, uh, you know, range kind of data. Let's say if you need some kind of range, you need data from 500 to 1000 only. Okay, you can enter currency type, euro, INR, dollars, right? Or leave it to generate in the dollar. So, dollar is a by default that it will generate. You can generate in other formats as well, right? So, let us keep in 500 to okay let's keep number range from 40,000 to 50,000 okay now let's generate So earlier, if you see, it was generating random numbers from nine four double six nine five one until the end, right? Now it will generate the test data as per your input. Okay. So see, these are the previous details. Now we will get the new data also. And on this website, you can also see, you know, uh, for this, there are a lot of, uh, you know, testing daily app is also there. You can install that particular testing daily app, right? So latest testing trends you can know from testing daily app. What is happening if any new tool or technology has come up in the market? So you can learn those things, right? So that's also very useful. So now it got generated, right? So you can see numbers, 43,535. So all the numbers in the range of four. 40,000 to 50,000 because we had entered this parameter, right? Now, let's say if I want to copy this data, so I can also copy, right? Copying to clipboard was successful. So this is also done. If I want to get new data, right? So again, you have to click on refresh or you can click on generate. So an entire new test data will be generated. You can also download this particular file auto test data one dot json right so i had earlier also downloaded it so that was auto test data dot json and now it's appending by one because this is the second file that i am downloading right now let's delete this particular data now let's say if i just want to generate names okay now again in names you have you have uh you know multiple pair property let's say if i want to go for first name right and right so this is first name okay simultaneously if i want to add one more for names and if i want to generate for uh last name so so i need test data for first name and last name right so i'll generate say click on generate okay so the data with first name and last name has come okay now if you want to shift last name first and then first name right so that also we can do okay. now let's say generate okay so last name is first first name is second so see it, it depends on what kind of data you want to generate let's say if you have some functionality in which you have to work with the uh, uh, banking accounts and it's an investment banking application that you are testing right that's a functionality 
of is of payment gateway or something kind of numbers that you need for permutation combination. So you can generate test data from here. We were discussing about that number range, right? Then if you want to play with the currency types, then euro, dollar, INR. So these all currency types are being supported, right? So you can use this test data tool to save your time because it will automatically generate the test data, right? So why, why don't, uh, you know, uh, we can save our time and we can utilize our time in testing rather than, you know, generating the test data, right? So that's where this tool is very, you know, useful. It's going to save a lot of time, a lot of efforts, and the result is also very quick. So you can see the moment we clicked on generate, the automatically those kind of data was getting generated, right? Now let's try with Excel file also. Let's say if I want file, uh, data in Excel, okay? So this is Excel related data, okay? Then we have separated by pipe option, right? So it is separated by pipe, right? So this is the beauty of this particular tool because you might need the test data in various formats, right? And it is just one click away. You can see, just click on generate and whatever, your data as per your need, it would be generated, right? So this is the video on auto test data, right? So please comment on this video once you use this tool and how you are using this tool. What are the different parameters that you are using them? So please put down in the comment section of this video and let us know how much this tool is useful to you, right? So thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, stay tuned for more updates. Thank you.